Hey guys, today we're going to talk about guessing square roots by using Newton's method. Guessing square roots by Newton's method. Now, consider a number a such that a equals x squared and we are trying to find x which is the square root of a. Now let's consider the function f of x equals x squared minus a and graph this. x squared minus a. This point corresponds to the negative a. And this point right over here is the square root of a. And we don't know what this number is. We are going to start with a guess, x0. Let's pick a guess, x0 right over here. I'll draw a tangent to this function at this point. The point that this tangent line crosses the x-axis has become my new guess. I'll label this point x1. Now I will do the same process over and over again. Draw a tangent and pick a new point x2. As you can see, as I repeat this process, uh, my points become closer and closer to the square root of a. And in each iterative step, I take a step towards the square root of a in this direction. And now let's see how we can calculate the magnitude of this step. For my first step, the slope of this line equals to the derivative of the function at x0. So the slope equals rise over run uh, the run is the magnitude that we are trying to calculate, let's call that step. And the rise is just the value that the function takes at x0, which is f of x0. Now we can easily see that step equals f of x0 over f prime of x0. But we have taken a step towards the negative side, so our new point x1 x1 equals x0 minus the step so x1 equals x0 minus f of x0 over f prime of x0 and for each point and for each iterative sp step the same logic applies so generally we can write xn plus 1 equals xn minus f of xn over x f prime of xn and yeah this is our formula for our case f of x equals x squared minus a so we can write xn plus 1 equals xn minus xn squared minus a over f prime of xn f prime of x is 2x so f prime of xn is 2xn Let's rearrange. And in more simple terms, now let's implement this formula into Python and play with it to see if it really works. Yeah, let's start writing codes in Python. So x is the number that we're trying to take the square root of. It's a float. Let's write enter a number to take the square root of. Y 
ok and let n be the number of iterations that we are repeating the Newton's method and will be an integer enter the number of iterations okay and here we need a first guess let's call this first guess x0 and usually x0 will be close to x over 2 but you can always make yourself a different first guess so i'll take a note here this is the first guess and you may change it as you wish for i in range n We will make a new guess. This new guess is the same as xn plus 1. New guess equals x0 over 2 plus x over 2 times x0. And this is the same formula that we figured out before. Now, I have a new guess, x0 equals new guess, and I will repeat this process for n times. And after this n times, I'll just print the result I've got, square root equals new guess okay so this is my code now let's try to work with it enter a number to take the square root of let's enter 19 Enter the number of iterations. A hundred. This is the computer's guess. Let's take this to the second power. And we see that it's really, really close to 19. So it's a very good guess.